safety systems on it. It's got uh, emergency stops all over it here, and these isolators, you can lock them off. So if anybody's doing any work on it, drop a padlock through there, no one can start it. You can't get electrocuted or anything like that. Totally a very, very safe system. Being an Australian design system too, all of the uh, circuits are double protected, so double RCD protection. The chances of somebody getting a shock of it are not great. If you were anchored for any length of time, there's an earth peg in here, you whip it out, drive it into the ground, then it really is safe. Really. But here in New Zealand, that's not a requirement under the law. But it doesn't need to happen. That engine's done 2,000 hours from new. Oops. Controls in there. Oh, we switch them all back on again. Goes through its little thing. joystick control, the, the, uh, if you can see past the veranda, the, uh, this one here makes the boom come in and out, it automatically stops when it senses overbalance, um, up, down and tilt the, the head to whatever direction you like. There's a, uh, a level, a square level over here, four wheel steer, that means four wheels can steer opposed, four wheels steer together for crabbing, uh, stabilizers up and down, this is a, a levelling key here which levels the back axles or even when you're standing without the stabilizers down you can go around the side of a, of a sideling and level the chassis. On level ground it can reach out about 17 meters before the safety system stops you going any further but as you go higher it'll reach out further so ultimately you can go right up to 20 meters and, and light up about 10 acres. 